Today we're going to make macaroni and cheese in the microwave. To make this recipe, you will need measuring cups and measuring spoons. You will need a cheese grater, a large mug, and a spoon. For ingredients, you will need a half cup of water, a half cup of pasta, I used macaroni, three tablespoons of milk, salt and pepper to taste, and a quarter cup of cheese. I use marble cheese. You may also want to consider toppings such as broccoli, bacon, chives, etc. So let's get started. First, you're going to want to grab your mug and mix the macaroni in it along with water okay. and a pinch of salt. Okay, give that a little stir. Okay, and then put it in the microwave for two to three minutes. I'm going to pause the video, microwave my pasta, and bring it right back. So we're back. I've given my macaroni a good stir. Now something to keep in mind that I just learned is that you should uh, keep an eye on your microwaved macaroni. Mine uh, overflowed a little bit in the microwave. So maybe just check it every few seconds, give it a little stir, make sure it's doing okay. And uh, either two or three minutes, I did about two and a half minutes to get to where I am. So the pass is not, uh, not too hard anymore. So we're gonna come back to our ingredient list now and add in the milk. So that's three tablespoons of milk we added. We're gonna add a little bit more salt and pepper. And it's up to you how much you put in here. It just says to taste. And then we will add our cheese, which I think is the most important part. Okay. Added those in, give it another quick stir. So that's what we're looking like so far. And then back in the microwave, this goes for another 30 seconds or so. Again, keep an eye on it. It might need to be a few extra seconds or a few more seconds. So we'll be right back. Okay, I've just taken my pasta out of the microwave. Give it one last stir and that's what it looks like. So again, you can garnish it with your favorite toppings. You could put some bacon or broccoli on it. You can even add a little bit more cheese to the top of it perhaps, um, or just leave it a classic mac and cheese. So now you can be careful, make sure it's nice and cool, and then enjoy. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoy your microwave macaroni and cheese.